to him. Some serious fog. Someone lives in that van. Good morning. <laughs> I love breakfast buffets. I love continental breakfast. That's my jam. I feel so tired though because the breakfast buffets end at 9.30. So we woke up at like 7.30, 8. I went down and ate. Now I'm going to do my makeup for the day. I don't really know where the day takes us, but we figure if we're in West Bumblefuck, New Jersey. Right on the border of the Delaware Water Gap where PA is. We might as well go antiquing since we only hit like two stores yesterday. Will you take a photo of know what foundation i wear i've always worn elf foundation but then elf came out with the camo cc cream um and it's not really technically a foundation but i wear it as foundation it's full coverage and it has spf in it which all of elf's products have spf in it so it's always really good that's so long some antique shops that we may want to go to it's the gloomiest day ever outside ever it is so gloomy out and jordan didn't bring a hoodie or pants and i didn't bring a hoodie but i brought this so i'm fine but he's just like laying under the covers like a little muffin are you okay maybe i'll nap for like an hour before checkout and then i guess we'll go
all packed up and ready to go, but we're gonna go back inside and use the bathroom one last time, I guess in the lobby, and make coffee or tea at the coffee bar, because why would you not take advantage of that? Normal. Turn left onto Clarkson Street, then turn right onto Dunn Place. No, this... <gasps> Are you fucking kidding me? The Merriam Casabella. It's a residential care facility. This is gorgeous. Look at the garage. That's insane. No, that was it. Oh my God, and they have like a whole back door. Look at the setup. No, this, these houses are on. This is like the matching set for the house behind it. This is the back of it. Left onto Main Street. I remember this last one too. We are at a bunch of antique stores now. This is a. We're in Andover, New Jersey. And it's like a little antique village. And there's an more antique stores across the street. They look like they have a flea market in the back. So get your thrifty pants on, girls and boys. How come everything about you in every way? Will you ever tell me what is in what isn't real? Cause all I ever do is miss you every single day. And I don't think I It's like I guess, oh my god! They have my things that I love. These are way cheaper than um, when I bought in uh, Vegas. When I bought in Vegas was 25, but it was also crystal. Feelings I caught. Do they mean anything to you? Do you think all the antiques are like so 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 affordable and then the vans that are not new are forty dollars I could just go to the store. That's so funny. Look at this, this is gorgeous. I found so many gorgeous rings. And I think that they're real. I mean they must be because they're locked away in a case. Unless they just don't want people to like take them, but Found some cool stuff. We're gonna do a haul later. It's like the only awkward thing. I had to give them my my pocketbook, I guess, because I think you know you could put things in it, or maybe it's a hazard or something. Or, so I get like kind of like nervous to walk away from it. Whatever. It's just one lady. I'm not gonna like argue with them because I want to walk around the store. But I've never really had to do that in an antique store before. So I'm like, <laughs> oh well. Said things that confuse you. I didn't mean to bet you would do. Please just understand these notions that you're really sick. No, give me a heavy, honest word. Do you love me enough? I cry. 
She told me about dying love And I don't wanna believe that heaven only exists from above It's been like the longest few hours. Coming home was so easy. But then when I came home, I had to go to TD Bank because the other day, Jordan, lost my card in the atm machine and it ate it I so i had to get a new card there's the ice cream man we went to subway <laughs> went to my house i unpacked all my stuff from pa came to jordan's house because we had to pick up his brother from the train then i had a phone call for like an hour now i want to finally show you my haul and then i also want to show you guys things that i got from et to love i love et to love this is where most of my jewelry is from this is my high priestess ring from et to love i'm going to link everything in the description about them i love them so so much i've done videos on them on youtube i've done videos on them on tiktok they are just the coolest jewelry brand ever they have other things besides jewelry but et to love is like incredible they had so much jewelry and you guys know obviously i'm a sucker for jewelry i'm a sucker for rings i think it's just so cool and i'm under the impression that everything was real even though it was quite cheap and like very very affordable um i'm gonna have to look inside the numbers are like this ring right here for instance this is my etta love ring not from the antique store it says 925 on the inside 925 means sterling silver so i need to like get my magnifying glass and look at the rings that i bought antiquing this ring is one of the rings that i got it on the inside says 14 carat made in india so i got this 14 carat ring is the diamond real probably not sometimes when i'm antiquing i feel like i could buy this ring like literally i bought three the three rings for thirty dollars but they were all in glass cases and i feel like if this is real that'd be so crazy and stupid like what it's a fucking diamond ring obviously you guys see the little like detailing around it and it kind of hangs over here secondly i got this dainty little one that has a tiny diamond up on the inside and it's a gold band it's very sleek and plain and i thought it would be really really nice to pair with this one because they look good together i actually think i put them on upside down they kind of look like a stackable ring this one doesn't say anything on the inside but it could easily be too old to be marked so i'm really unsure so it could either be fake or not fake or i don't know this one was marked as five dollars so it could be fake or it could just be so old that there were no numbers in them i could look up what dates those standards were kind of set in place i got this emerald ring with this beautiful cut with diamonds on the side and i just think it's so gorgeous and it has a little gold band and i kind of couldn't read what it said on the inside in the shop because it was very dark in there but i could probably read it now in natural light i like need a magnifying glass it says Ugh, I need a magnifying glass. So I got three gorgeous rings antiquing and I thought that was so amazing and so awesome. So now let me show you my non-antiqued things from Etta Love. Very, very timeless in the way that they're created. So we go like that. We do a little bit of this. We do a little bit of that. Oh my God. It was wrapped up in the packaging before, 
but I went ahead and put my pendant together. So they just released their gold line. They haven't had gold jewelry before, um, and now they do. They did only have sterling silver for quite some time, so I went ahead and picked up some two gold pieces. This one is the rose pendant. It is so cool, so gorgeous. Comes on a super long chain like this, and I think it is so pretty. On the clamps, it also has little roses, if you guys could tell and see. It's just, their jewelry is so amazing and so gorgeous, and I feel like all of their pieces always fit with the jewelry that I already have in my jewelry collection and what I buy don't look so beautiful together one's antique and one's not but it just looks so so beautiful ring nonetheless because I do not have a gold ring from them look how cute so so cute so I got this to match on my ring finger it has the black what is it tourmaline Black what? What is it called? Black onyx? Is it onyx? Probably onyx. Or obsidian. Black onyx or obsidian black onyx or obsidian beautiful gorgeous details like up on the sides jordan actually has this ring in the sterling silver version so i think that's kind of cool we're matching i'm gold he's silver they just look so pretty and they look so pretty next to my fun antique rings everything about et to love will be linked in the description so if you are new here I do this thing called Vlogoween where I upload every single day, all 31 days of October. Thank you so much for coming along with me and making my journey worthwhile. If you want and you like this video at any point, please subscribe. And of course, I will see you guys tomorrow in my next Vlogoween video. Mm -hmm.